Now which? <laughs> now which is what brings us together today. <laughs> now which? That blessed arrangement. That dream within a dream. <laughs> and love, true love, <laughs> will follow you forever. So treasure your love. <laughs> oh, as the maid of honor and the sister of the party, <laughs> I guess I'm meant to tell some embarrassing stories about Karen. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to embarrass myself up here more than I can ever embarrass Karen. <laughs> Karen has a raw honesty about her that allows her to be playful and funny. She has an incredible spirit. Karen is someone who follows her heart. In fact, she followed her heart all the way to Alberta. I myself have been living outside of Canada for a number of years now. So the opportunities to get to know David have been few. Karen visited me in San Francisco last February when my son was very young. And while she was there, David sent her a bouquet of chocolate roses for Valentine's Day. We did meet one time, actually, at Thanksgiving a number of years ago. From that encounter, I gathered that David is relaxed, he likes vegan mint pie, and he's crazy about Karen. Karen has only wonderful things to say about David. I hear over and over that he was very sweet and very thoughtful. Having spent time with David and Karen this past week, it's plain to see that you were both very in sync and are very concerned about each other's well-being and happiness. As Karen's sister, I'm so happy that you found each other, and I look forward to getting to know you better, David, my new brother-in-law. So who here has heard the story of Karen and David when they started dating? <laughs> I, um, I know it. <laughs> I told Karen over the phone, actually, that I had intended to write her a little song about this and sing it here. And I didn't have time because I had my young son, Laz. And she said, Aww! <laughs> so I had to go on a ukulele <laughs> and teach myself a couple chords the past week. <laughs> so I can't play the ukulele and I can't sing. But I'm going to try. Person, as I know you two have found each other. 